I'm ready to go. Now, here's your host, the one and only Mike North. Well, it only took six years. Back <laughs> on the air. Oh, just like I planned it. Oh, folks, are we going to have some fun today? We are going to be hanging out. Welcome to the Mike North pregame show. And without further ado, I have to introduce and just make sure you're talking to the mic, all right, troublemaker. It's my buddy, my pal, the pride and joy of Notre Dame, the pride and joy of the Chicago Bears, Chicago Vocational High School, South Side guy, all around guy. It's Chris Orge. How are you, Chris? Thank you, thank you, sir. I'm doing wonderful. You're feeling good. You're jacked, jacked up. You're not sitting. It's you're ready day. to go. It's game day. Well, you know, fathers are telling their kids, "This is the guy that used to do this," and he's got all these other guys that used to do it with them. And he, we got Chris Orge, and then we got the the guy who he says to me two weeks ago, "Well, well, I'm getting a bachelor party that weekend." And I go, "I don't care. You want to be on the air?" He goes. Damn right. Well, I can't do him because he is the base himself. It's a Mr. Dan Levy. What's up, Danny? What up, guys? What up? Wow. Good morning. Good morning. We have our own Barry White. That's awesome. Oh, that's awesome. That's yeah. awesome. The Chicago Bears, we got about a minute to go before we take the break. But the, That's about all we need. That's all we need. <laughs> that, Cincinnati, we real minute. quick. Cincinnati and Bears today starting to starting the day out right. Correct. How are they going to win? I. You know what? It's such a good defense coming from the Bengals. The Bears' offense, it's all we know about right now is how good the offense is going to be. If the offensive line can hold that defense and Jay Culler can make passes and make plays, then, yes, they got a good shot at winning. By the way, by the way, I was going to say this, too. I was going to say this, too. This is very important. Dad, you don't have to explain to your kids anymore about who you're listening to, okay? I know there's a lot of guys that have been out there saying, Mike, when are you coming back? Mike, every day. People, when are you coming back? When are you coming back? Mike, i got to explain to my kid how sports radio used to be. He's 10 <laughs> years old. He's 10 years old. He listens now. He goes, it's pretty good, Dad. Well, I used to listen to this guy. Where, where, where is he? Well, he's sort of in exile, son. But you know what? When he comes back, we'll put him on. Well, now you hear me, son. And to, oh, well, all the kids out there, all the kids out there, believe in yourselves. If you want to be on the radio, you want to be a, an architect, you want to be a diplomat, which we need some. Nowadays, diplomat, you can do everything, anything you want, and don't end and don't end your dreams before they start. Believe me when I tell you this.